Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. My name is of course Constantine and today in the world of indie gaming we're going to be checking out a game called Tiny Land. Uh, this is a game that I actually came across very recently. I had no idea about this one and as soon as I saw a little bit of a gameplay from developers I was really impressed with what they have created here. Uh, this game is going to be really gorgeous. It's going to be a really chill one. Uh, something that you can easily just uh, relax and play on the weekends I guess. Uh, but something that I'm planning to if you guys of course enjoy i'm planning to maybe make a stream where we can all just hang out chat a little bit and uh do some of these puzzles why not so without further ado guys before we jump into this one let me just take a quick moment to thank the developers for sending in a copy of the game to share with you all and uh if you guys enjoy this and want to grab it for yourselves there is going to be a link in the description as usual as i usually provide for all the games that i feature on the channel all right that being said let's uh just uh start up the game and uh keep in mind i've never played this game of it before but uh, I'm pretty sure it's not going to be difficult to play at all. I'm pretty sure this is going to be a really enjoyable experience. I mean, I guess we can start with the first one here. Let's see what it's all about. Find the differences. I mean, this is just going to be a game where you can easily just explore the world a little bit. And uh, play at your own pace. Like this right here. Those rocks were definitely a little bit different from each other. Uh, I believe that the bird here is a little bit different as well. For sure, yeah. Um, let's see, what else we got? These fishes seem to be the same, but this flower seems to be a little bit different. There we go, perfect. And by doing this, we are collecting some stars. I don't know exactly what's going to happen once we collect more stars. Maybe we're going to be able to unlock more levels by grabbing as many... As these differences as possible. Um, the tree seems to be the same. Hmm. I don't really see anything. Oh, look at that. The tree here seems to be different in a different position at least. Alright. And we are getting close to actually finishing this up. Um, hmm. Anything different around here? You definitely have to pay attention, of course, from time to time. Uh, trying to look at every single detail, I guess. Because eventually, there is going to be something that is going to be a little bit different. Uh, we just started the game, but I'm pretty sure... Look at this. I'm pretty sure that this flower is different as well, right? Or maybe not. I'm guessing it's uh, it looks different because uh, on this side... The wood is falling and the, and the other one is not. Um, I was just about to say that as we keep on progressing here, I'm pretty sure that the levels are going to keep on getting more and more difficult. Um, details are going to be uh, more difficult to spot. I mean, at the moment, I'm saying that as we keep on going, but I'm having difficulties trying to find the final detail, though. Hmm. Interesting. I'm definitely not... Looking properly. Is there anything that I'm missing? The great thing about this is that if I'm going to do this in a live stream, all of you guys can also help me up. Uh, tell me what I'm missing. Um, it's definitely going to be much easier when... It's definitely going to be much easier when more eyes are going to be looking at this uh, rather than just my two eyes. <laughs> We're definitely going to be able to uh, go through these levels much, much faster. That's for sure. Hmm. I mean, I just cannot spot the funnel missing object. That is so weird. I'm pretty sure it's going to be something on these trees. Hold up. Let me look at these patterns on the trees. What about this one? So this one seems to be the same. Oh, you know what? It's this one. Never mind. We found it. All right. Look at that. The first level has been done. This game is so gorgeous, though. Really, really gorgeous. Really enjoying what I've done here. And again, as I was saying, it's going to be a really, really chill game. Something you can easily just play when you have... Uh, when you don't really want to... When you don't really want to play a game that's too try-hard, I guess. Something you can easily just enjoy. 
All right, this fish is a little bit different in a different location, I guess. Um, hmm. uh, this wood in the middle here, I guess. Something is a little bit different here. Hold up. Is it? Uh, it is not. Never mind. Uh, I feel like, again, these trees are going to have different patterns. I'm not sure just yet. Um, oh, this one is different. This one is larger than this one for sure. Uh, let's see, do we have the same amount of firewood here? Yeah, I, I think we do. I think we do. All right. Uh, we have the same amount of leaves in the trees. Man, we still have to find two more, but uh, I'm having a little bit of an issue um, noticing the differences. Hmm. The tools seem to be the same. This guy doesn't seem to have any differences, though. I see that it's pretty much the same as for this fellow right here. Yeah, he definitely looks the same as well. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, the thing is, you cannot really move the camera as you please. You can only go round and round or zoom in and out. That is only that's the only thing you can do. So if I would like to zoom into this location, it's never going to work. Um, I'm guessing some of these flowers may not have the same amount of leaves, maybe. Probably, I don't know. Let's see, we got three leaves here. All right. <laughs> I'm definitely missing something. Again, as we are getting close to finding all the pieces in the puzzle, we are slowly gonna miss some of them for sure. I mean, I don't even know if uh, the grass can actually be a little bit different. It should have something that should stand out, right? Since there's... Oh, hold up. I think... Yeah, I think this grass piece is different. Is it? No, I don't think it is. I think it's uh, looking different just because of the size. Uh, just because this barrel is covering part of it. Oh! Hold up. This one is different. It's positioned in a different position. There we go. I knew there was something wrong with this one. I just couldn't figure it out. All right, and finally, we need one more thing. Uh, and I'm guessing it's not that. Hmm. I should be losing points whenever I'm clicking randomly. <laughs> just so that it doesn't encourage me to just click around like a maniac. Hmm. So nothing around here that I see different. Nothing in there. It's definitely the same. There are three fishes in here. This one, the big one that moved. Um, hmm. Oh, is this thing different? No. I feel like there should be something different with the table, maybe. A small, small difference that I'm missing. Oh, is the package in his bow? Never mind. Look at that. Man, you really, really have to pay attention. All right, find the differences. I mean, look at how gorgeous this is. The art style in this game is just really, really beautiful. It's using this low poly style to it that. I'm actually a big, big fan of these type of uh, artworks. It's just so beautiful. 
Alright, and I already see a difference with the pigeon here. I already see a sword missing on this one. Um, I already see this one, uh, the broom, being a little bit different positioned, I guess. I already see this red fish being different. There we go. And we need one more. That was so fast. <laughs> we went through this level so fast, but I have a feeling the final one... Uh, might be really, really difficult to find, to spot. And uh, it's going to take us quite a while to figure it out. Let's see. Am I really going to take that long to figure it out? Or are we going to be able to just fly through this level? Hmm. Nothing different on this side. Nothing different on this side. At least I don't see it at the moment. I feel like this is the, the one. There we go. Wow, just like I thought we we're going to be able to fly through this level. I don't know why this was the, so easy, though. <laughs> Alright, and this one's going to be the final level, guys. Find the differences. I mean, this is just so gorgeous. This game is beautiful. There's... There's nothing else I can say. <laughs> it's just beautiful. Alright, uh, let's just finish this one up. And, um... I believe... Actually, this is the same. Yeah, this package is a little bit bigger than the other one. Um, hmm. Got a mushroom. I think... No, no, this is the same, never mind. I thought there was an extra piece of wood there. Um, this is definitely the same. These are also definitely the same as well. What's that sound? Uh, the flowers definitely look the same to me. Alright, well, if the previous level was really easy, this is uh, definitely... Gonna be more complex, that's for sure. Hmm. I think this rock is actually positioned differently. Yeah, there we go. Uh, what about the soldiers here? Let's see. Huh. I mean, they definitely look similar. Okay, never mind. The shield is different. Okay. Uh, what about the bottles in the back there, though? Let's see. Any different colors? I don't see it. Uh, the flags, maybe? Mm, not really. The flags definitely look the same. At least from that perspective. Let me turn them around again and see. Uh, yep, they are definitely the same. Hmm. Alright, well, we need to find three more. There are just so many games similar to this one out there that... I keep on searching, trying to... Trying to play, just because, I don't know, I feel like playing these type of games can be so relaxing. Uh, I'm not sure if uh, this game is also available on mobile, though. Uh, I mean, I, at the moment I'm playing this one on the on the PC. Uh, I did notice something different here. At the moment I am playing this one on the PC. Uh, but I feel like this could easily just run on uh, different platforms as well. Hmm. I feel like maybe the wood piece is below here might have one that may be a little bit different. Let's see, can we actually spot it? Pretty sure there's going to be one that's going to be a little bit different or has a little bit different on it. I mean, as far as I can see, they all seem to be the same. Yeah. Alright, what about their source then? Well, we still need to find two more, but it looks like Oh, never mind. These two flags are positioned a little bit differently. Yeah, 
Uh, this one is moved to the right side a little bit more than this one. Alright, so we got that one. We need one more. Hmm. Interesting. One more final object. But I wonder where it could be. As I was saying, whenever I'm going to find it, I'm definitely going to have an aha moment. <laughs> because... I feel like I've been watching at every single corner here, everything, every single thing, and I just cannot spot the difference. Hmm. Oh wait, what? It was a bottle, I knew it. So what was the difference with that bottle? I don't even know. I have no idea. I just wanted to click there. I was thinking that maybe there was some sort of a bottle that's different and I'm not noticing it. And apparently that's exactly what it was. <laughs> Alright guys, well, there you have it. This game is called Tiny Land, and if you guys are looking for a game like this, where you can easily just relax, try to play a game that you don't really have to frustrate you that much, just have a chill moment. This is definitely the one, definitely the one that you're looking for. It's also really gorgeous, I gotta tell you. I'm really, really enjoying this uh, poly style that developers have used here. It's really great, especially this map here. I mean, look at this. It's really beautiful. <laughs> Alright everybody, anyway, if you guys enjoyed this and want to see more videos like this in the future, make sure to hit on the like button down below as that is a great way to support the channel. And if you guys are new here and have subscribed yet, do consider doing that. And I will see you all in the next video coming up really soon. Bye everybody!